What is up, guys? It is Toku's Tacos, and today we are picking back up where we left off in Skyrim. We had just gotten in. We were chased by that troll. Uh, we are going to be getting in and talking to the Greybeards, as you guys can see right there. The quest just went and popped up. This is picking up on the story. This is part three, I believe. I believe it's part three or four. Um, I will kind of start labeling these as parts. This is probably going to be chopped up into... 15 minute segments uh, just so it's not a massive upload I'm looking at gonna be about an hour to two hours of Skyrimery I sounded more clever in my head but let's get into it let's do it let's talk to the fucking graybeards so a dragonborn appears at this moment in the turning of the age we will see if you truly have the gift Show us, Dragonborn. Let us taste of your voice. Fools! You wanted a taste of my voice, motherfucker. I mean, it's kind of pathetic and pussy vibe, but... It is you. Welcome to High Hrothgar. Thank you. I am Master Angir. I speak for the Greybeards. Awesome. Now, tell me, Dragonborn. Why have you come here? Mm, I want to find out, yeah. Well, we are here to guide you in that pursuit. Just as the Greybeards have sought to guide those of the Dragon that came before you. Fucking right. You are not the first. There have been many of the Dragon Blood since Akatosh first bestowed that gift upon mortal kind. Whether you are the only dragonborn of this age, that is not ours to know. You are the only one that has been revealed thus far. That is all I can say. You have shown that you are dragonborn. You have the inborn gift. But do you have the discipline and temperament to follow the path laid out for you? That remains to be seen. Without training, you have already taken the first steps towards projecting your voice into a thoom, a shout. Now let us see if you are willing and able to learn. When you shout, you speak in the language of dragons. Thus, your dragon blood gives you an inborn ability to learn words of power. All shouts are made up of three words of power. As you master each word, your shout will become progressively stronger. Master Einarth will now teach you Roll, a second word in unrelenting force. Roll means balance in the dragon tongue. Combine it with Fus, force, to focus your thumb more sharply. Roll. But it, you're, you're kind of... Motherfucker, you're on the goddamn words. Yeah, I get the fucking lost. You learn a new word like a master. You truly do have the gift. But learning a word of power is only the first step. You must unlock its meaning through constant practice. <laughs> well, that is how the rest of us learn shouts. As Dragonborn, you can absorb a slain dragon's life force and knowledge directly. As part of your initiation, Master Einarth will allow you to tap into his understanding of Rome. Whoa, that's awesome. Just sticking it out there, guys. Use your unrelenting force shout to strike the targets as they appear. Get the fuck out the way! Well done. Again. Ah! 
Well, that's pretty fucking easy. It is kind of the start of the story, so... Nice and slow, as always. Yay! I did it! Your thumb is precise. You show great promise, Dragon Ball. We will perform your next trial in the courtyard. Follow, Master Boy. And to let you guys know, I'm not playing with mods at all. This is kind of just a vanilla version of the remastered of Skyrim that we're playing. So, uh, no mods, no help, no increased difficulty. We are playing, I believe, on hard. So, it's going to be fun. Yeah, we're playing the hard, no mods. I uh, will do a few uh, playthroughs uh, with mods, kind of like might do my own storyline where it's a super survival mode. If you guys want to do that, comment in, in the sections. Let me know if you would love to see that or not. Quick, quick mastery, mastery of a new thune is uh, astonishing. I'd heard the stories of the abilities of Dragonborn, but to see it for myself? You are now ready for your last trial. Retrieve the horn of Jürgen Winkola, our founder, from his tomb in the ancient fane of Ostengrad. Remain true to the way of your voice, and you will return. No doubt, the appearance of a dragonborn of this time is not an accident. Your destiny is surely bound up with the return of the dragons. You should focus on honing your voice, and soon your path will be made clear. Good. Then you, then you will, will be ready, ready for whatever lies ahead. Fucking right I will. Scott? Woo! We gotta walk ahead of us, guys. That's gonna be one long fucking trip. So, let's go to... nope. Mm, more thrall. We'll go to the stables. Uh, maybe pay for a ride there. Um, well, no. I'd like to walk, but I don't know if you guys want to see all that shit. don't know if you guys want to watch me walk everywhere. <laughs> we'll just pay to go, uh, you know, so we can finish this trial.
Hi, how you doing? Need a ride? Where do you want to go? Climb and back, and we'll be off. Nice weather for a ride. Hope it lasts. It's nightfall. It's not nice weather. It's a nightfall. Hopefully you guys are going to enjoy this uh, series. Is pretty much, it's just a story based series. Uh, probably do side quests. Maybe join. Uh, it's going to include DLC. That's definitely going to be broken up. Uh, ooh, cold weather we're having here. Uh... But yeah, we're going to break up the series whenever the DLC shit starts happening. So hopefully you guys will enjoy that. I'm rather excited for that, honestly. And I pretty much want to get this series out. Not really as fast. Probably take our time. Maybe uh, one or two videos a week. And I might add, after this series is done, I might do the survival series of this, where it has the mods that make everything super hard, super realistic, such as the Frostbite mod, the Cold and Wet mod, and quite a bit of other mods that make it realistic and do nothing with Dragonborn. Maybe a Mage, or a Wilderness Survival, or something like that. Uh, but let me know in the comments below on kind of what you guys want to see with the mods. If you want a alternate story start where it has nothing to do with Dragonborn. Because I've looked into alternate start. You can be mage, you can be a warrior, imperial, you know, all sorts of other stuff. And just not even mess with Dragonborn. If you guys want to see that, let me know. Now without further ado, let's continue onwards. What's the y'all going to do about it? How are we supposed to feel safe in our own homes? Please, enough already. By the gods, it's true, is it? A dragon has attacked White Rock. How could mere men bring down such a beast? There's no need for wizards in our midst. Mordor has enough problems as it is. Ah, it's no use. Unless it's about the mill. I trust you saw the house that burned down. Peculiar bit of business, that bus. And that's on top of noises from the marsh in the night. Tales of monsters. Now this wizard in our midst. What's a man to do if he can't look to his yar for help? The world's going mad. She hides inside with her visions. We need a leader. How can I? She never speaks with us. She's allowed this wizard, Falcon, to live in our midst practicing gods know what. And now there's talk of rebellion and dragons? But help could Idgrat be against them? No. no. We can, we can only, only rely on ourselves. ourselves. You do, do well, well to remember that. Um I'm gonna pick up the side quest. I think it's a side quest. I'm just gonna I'm gonna pick it up because we have yet to go to the tomb. But we're already here, so let's pick it up! Woohoo! Lydia. You look, you look sick. sick. I hope it's, it's not contagious. Well go fuck yourself! The divines reveal things to me at times, yes. I do not hide this. It is a gift. Anyone who believes otherwise does not and cannot understand it. That which is unknown can create unease, even fear. It is to be expected. Some fear our new resident wizard. As they grow to know him, they will accept him. Time will prove me right. I stand where I have always stood. Now is not the time to fight amongst ourselves. I fear dark days approach, and all of Skyrim's strength will be needed. You are so fucking useless. I'll come back and adventure this area later. I mean, I... You there. You're the one they call Dragonborn. What the f... Fuck you, people! What? And granted, people, I remember, I have not played this, guys, since 2011, when it originally came out, November 11th, on the year 11. It was 11, 11, 11. It was one of the most hyped, perfect time game releases. So I don't really remember much of Skyrim. At all. Like, barely anything. Because it was on the 360. I played it a couple times, but I kind of remember a few things, but not everything, especially story-wise and side quest wise Completely know nothing about it. You, 
Your lies fall on deaf ears, deceiver. The true dragonborn comes. You are but his shadow. When Lord Mirak appears, all shall bear witness. Oh my god. Fucking altists. Oh, good god, my health. I'm not even paying a fuck attention. Yeah, we'll add that. I'll take, uh, I'll take some of your shit, buddy. Still arrows. Kind of like their design. I don't care about cultist masks. Get the fuck up, Lydia. Hell, that sells for a lot of money. Hell yeah. Let's see. Bar the vessel north. Maiden dogs. A river rock. Take it to Windhelm. Then begin your search. Kill the false dragon more known as Toku before she reaches Solstice. Return with word of your success, and Marcus shall be pleased. Well, we don't need that, so. I need to change my shell. Shut the fuck up. You should absolutely shut the fuck up. We're going this way. Have you seen my mother? I'm still. Papa says that I shouldn't keep waiting. Why not? Why must I come home soon? Oh, what happened? Try to keep my eyes open. Damn dragons could swoop down at any time. What happened? Damn dragon, my fucking asshole. We're gonna do that quest later. Uh. I think we're gonna be able to do that quest later, guys. For now, we're gonna do Dragonborn, so. Let's keep at it! Do this! Through the wild! Of course, this is also, you know, it's Skyrim, but it's also, you know, flower picking simulator. Ah, damn it, that's not gonna kill him. Oh well. On the woods, tracking through the snow. I mean, I do love it. I mean, just look at it, guys. Just, here, let me get up. Let me get up somewhere nice. So you guys can actually see this shit. Like, just, just look at that. Is that not amazing? Now, I know there are mods out there that increases everything, but still, it's just absolutely amazing. I love it. Of course, if you do do uh, plays like I do where I play the game, I usually like Turtle Beach so I can hear everything. They've actually enhanced the game's audio and increased a little bit of extra audio for Turtle Beaches or, you know, additional headset sounds. So... I hear the footprints, I hear the snow smushing, I hear the wind roaring. And then quiet enough, I can actually hear the trees creaking. I hear trees creaking. It just it's crazy what they do with this re with this whole redone Skyrim special edition. I absolutely love it. I've always been a fan of Elder Scrolls. Um the only Elder Scrolls that I really don't play too much it would have been 
that would have to be the Elder Scrolls Online. I probably should have played more of it, but uh, I just never did. I just never did. I mean, maybe at some point I'll get around to it. Where the fuck am I going? It says to go that direction, which is that way. Oh my god, I'm not following that goddamn quest. I'm going to Arvinstad. Wow. I guess my game decided to be a little retarded. Sorry about that, guys. We were literally headed to absolutely nowhere. Because our quest tells us... Wait. No. This. Yes, this. figure out what this is, and then we'll head over there. I was on the wrong quest. I thought Dragon Ball was our, uh, our, uh, major, major quest, but it's not. It's a fucking side quest. I mean, I do have to figure that out at some point, but that's beside the point. Let's get rid of For now, we're gonna go, we're gonna go here. I can find this shit. There's a shed! Crossing the water. So this this video has kind of been, uh, at least this part of the video is mostly uh, just traveling. It's just traveling. I right, we're here, but I do want to figure out what the hell that shed is. So we're going to get to the shed, guys. And then we're actually... Oh! Hi, motherfuckers! I'm gonna die. I'm gonna fucking... Carrot. Ah, oh, fucking A, we died. Well, I think I'm going to leave it here, guys. Uh, we will continue on. And of course, I'll probably do the intro. It's going to be split up videos, so expect that. But we'll continue in the next part. As always, guys, if you liked the video, make sure to leave a like. And subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. And I will see you guys in the next episode.